Uh, good morning. Just enjoying a smoke here out of my pipe with tobacco in it because uh, today we're going to be reviewing a uh, movie, a classic movie about art. But we'll get to that in a minute. Today, uh, being Wednesday, middle of the week, it's snack day, and here's our snack for today. See that? It's mana. It's a flavored kettle corn sent to us by uh, Joe White of Culinary Creations in uh, Marietta, Georgia, though. Thanks for sending that out to us, Joe. Well, I've already been enjoying some of it. Uh, so we have a really good snack today, but a really bad movie, I'm sorry to say. The movie is Fake. Yes, Fake. And it uh, it's a 2010 release, and it stars... Uh, Gabriel Mann as the artist, Jill Flint, you might know her from Royal Pains and the Good Wife on TV fame, and Robert Logia, who was uh, plays the bad guy in uh, Scarface. Um, this is a story about an artist that has no vision, at least that's what the people at all the art galleries say, but he has a great quality for uh, copying museum pieces of uh, great artists of the 15th and 16th century. The lead actor, Gabriel Mann, never, uh, I never heard of him, but Laura Flint, uh, um, she at least is hot. So she adds a little bit to the, uh, to the show. And, uh, Robert Logia, he plays the really good, uh, good, uh, crime boss here. So he's, he's entertaining. So Logia is the crime boss who's addicted to art and, uh, he uh, has gotten this Gabriel Mann, the talented artist, to recreate these art pieces that you see in the library. And then he switches them because he's got a friend in security that can get in the museums. Uh, the whole problem with the movie is you really couldn't reproduce art from the 15th or 16th century because where are you going to get the ink? Where are you going to get the, the matting and the, uh, and the canvases? So, it, you know, that it's really totally unbelievable. Uh, <clears throat> the movie really doesn't tie to tie well together at the end and uh, you know so we're gonna just have to wait to tomorrow to get a uh, a better movie to send out uh, a review for you on so today this one is getting our coveted outhouse award yeah so not worth seeing but uh, there's plenty more movies so just tune in tomorrow and we'll see what we can come up with for you have a good day